Hey gang, Jagalair here. Uh, a few of you might know that I went to uh, Canada not too long ago. I uh, had a craving for some barbecue Doritos and since they do not sell them in the States here anymore, I drove uh, a three hours round trip to get them. While I was up there, however, I also picked up a bunch of anime, relatively cheap, which was surprising because I didn't know that Canada had cheap anime. I don't know why they would. Uh, but while I was there, walking through, I glanced up and saw uh, this guy, who I looked at and went, holy crap, that's uh, Bumblebee. I think that's Bumblebee from the animated series. And then I looked at it and I was like, no, no, silly, that's Justice Hero. But uh, it was in a place called Dollarama, and this is uh, number two of the Transformable Robot series, which of course those are not, those don't look familiar at all, so I'm pretty sure those are completely not Transformers. But I decided to go ahead and snag him. He was $2 Canadian, which works out to be a dollar something uh, US. We decided to kind of just show him to you real quick. All right, and here he is. Our very own, what do they call him again? Justice Hero. Now he is very flimsy, just like a Dollarama is basically the dollar store knockoff in Canada, or vice versa, whichever. He has weird, you can see in there, he does have hands, but they don't, they don't, like they've got too many joints or something there. But he does look amazingly, and the weird thing is, is that I thought he was just like, oh, this is a weird knockoff where they tried to get it as close as they could to him. But he just kind of tucks in here. But no, the there's actually a uh, uh, transformer that's just like this guy. Uh, I found him on Amazon once I got back home. All right, and there he is. So, like I said, he's very hollow in back. He does sort of roll, <laughs> but other than that, he just uh, sits there. Let me go ahead and get we'll put him there. Uh, let's see, for comparison of size, there is a new 3DS XL, so he's that big. Just what I have. It feels like it just doesn't fit together right. Like it should, but it doesn't. And then transform him back. Just pull these out. Slide this back up. His head pops out. His legs go down, his legs do separate. Or they did, there we go. And he does actually have some articulation, so he can, he can look all cool. His arms still weird me out though. And the toy that comes out actually has two additional pieces. They look like weird little thruster things. And I'll sh put a picture up there so you can see it but the weird thing is once you start messing with his legs you are highly likely never to be able to <gasps> get him to stand up again which I just did out of frame but there he is I wish I had another transformer to put him next to but I don't so so there he is the transformable robot uh, obviously not bumblebee completely not uh, but um, found it for two bucks uh, playing on next trip I'm gonna go back to Dollarama now and look for the rest of them, specifically Optimus Prime, just because, hey, it's Optimus Prime. 
I mean, not Optimus Prime, but it's Optimus Prime. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, play on!